Hello guys and gals, welcome to one of how to smartphones tutorial videos on the iPhone XS Max. In this video I'll be showing you guys how to do the activation or the startup, getting through uh, to the home screen, starting your device up for the very first time. So I'm just going to go ahead, start off with the power button, press and hold the power button. And we can see that the Apple logo uh, turns on. At that point I released the uh, power button. So the model that I have is the iPhone XS Max, uh, just the base 64 gigabyte version. Um, it is on the Verizon network, purchased straight from Apple. So next screen we have here is the hello screen. So we can go ahead and swipe up. It's going to ask for a language. We'll go ahead and select English. I'm in the United States, so I'll go ahead and do that. There is a quick start option. I'm going to go ahead and set up manually. And here it's asking me for my internet, so I'm just going to go ahead and type in my internet. So there we have it. I have my internet now typed in. So I'm going to go ahead and hit join. I should hook up with the um, internet connection here with the Wi-Fi and I should be able to activate it this method. It says it may take a few minutes to activate your iPhone. Um, at this stage I've had issues in the past. If you don't have a SIM card in there it will say something about oh can't be activated, no SIM card. Um, things like that. So it says your iPhone could not uh, be activated because the activation server could not be reached. Try connecting your iPhone to iTunes to activate it or try again in a couple of minutes. This pro uh, if this problem uh, persists, contact Apple support at apple.com backslash support. So let's go ahead and try this again and see what happens. So here we go. It finally went through. This is on the next screen. It says data and privacy. Um, this icon appears when, the Apple, when an Apple feature asks you, uh, asked to use your personal information. You won't see this with any other feature, blah, blah, blah. So we'll go ahead and hit continue. Um, Face ID, you can go ahead and set it up now. I'm going to go ahead and set this up later in settings. Passcode options, I'm going to not use a passcode, so it's going to be clear. It'll be accessible. Are you sure you don't want to use a passcode? Um, don't use passcode. And then here it says if you're going to be restoring, uh, restoring from iCloud, from iTunes, set up as a new device or move data from Android. I'm just going to go ahead and set up as a new iPhone. It's going to ask to um, sign in with an Apple ID. I'm going to go ahead and select that I don't have one and I'm going to set it up later in settings. Are you sure you don't want to use an Apple ID? Yes, I'm sure I don't want to use it. And then it's just going to go ahead, take me to the terms and conditions page. I'm going to go ahead and select agree. And then it's going to be um, express settings. I'm just going to go ahead and continue. You can customize them. I'm just going to continue just to get through it. Uh, keep your iPhone up to date. I'm going to go ahead and uh, continue with that. And then I, uh, iMessage and FaceTime. Uh, not now. Here we have Siri. I'm going to go ahead and set that up later in settings. Um, set the screen time. Set that up later in settings as well. Um, any app analytics I usually don't share. Um, True tone display. I'm going to go ahead and continue. Select the view, the standard or the zoomed. It's going to go with the one that is already preset. And then from here we have um, swipe up from the home edge of your device. It's got a few little um, different things to go through. A little quick tutorial that they have. Uh, and here we have it. We are on the Welcome to the iPhone. Swipe up. And there you have it. There is the iPhone home screen. So as you guys can see, um, it does have that iPhone, has that iPhone XS uh, background there with that little cool globe looking ball with a bunch, a bunch of colors. So a bunch of apps more than you usually see. They've got a bunch of them over there, but that is it. This is the iPhone XS Max, and just like that, you are able to get into the home screen. So that is how to activate or start up, set up your um, iPhone XS Max. Hope you guys found this video helpful. If you did, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. If you guys have any other kind of comments, questions, or concerns, go ahead and drop those in the comment section below. That's all i got for you guys in this one. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.